in this view from a space shuttle Atlantis camera showing deployment of the solar array wing. This is the 1A channel, the forward wing on the new PS4 truss element. ISS Houston on the big loop. If you're deploying a array, the abort. Okay, Houston, no, we aborted. Thank you. And Steve, just a heads up, we were uh, going on the 1545 call there. Yeah, I understand uh, we weren't quite back with you, uh, but we will be shortly. Okay, we'll stand by. At Houston ISS, uh, we see about a little over four bays out at this point. ISS Houston on the big loop, and you may continue the, de the deploy in accordance with 15.7. Yeah, that's an order. And Houston ISS deploy command set. And we see that. The crew on board the Space Shuttle and Space Station Complex continuing the deployment of the 1A channel uh, solar array wing. This is the forward panel, set of panels on the new PS4 uh, truss element.
This procedure involves deploying the solar array, array wing about halfway out to the uh, to about 49% uh, and allowing the array to pause and be warmed by the sunlight, ensuring that the coating on the panels does not stick as uh, the solar array is uh, commanded to deploy fully. The pause will last about 30 to 40 minutes before uh, continuing on with the deployment. And abort command uh, sent at 1553, Houston. We copy, thank you. ISS Houston, that looks like a good nominal deploy to 49%. And we concur, Steve. Looks good. I'll uh, say again. And we're ready to pick up with you in 15.9. Okay, go in there. Deployment of this solar array wing paused at 49% of it deployed. And Houston ISS, we can confirm 15 and a half mass boys, mass bays are deployed, and it looks like a nominal deployment. All uh, indicators are good. Thank you, and we copy that.